Hey everybody, I'm here today to show you and tell you how to turn on Beats Flex earphones. This will be an easy tutorial for beginners, so let's get right into the video. As you can see right here, these are my new Beats Flex earphones, and I absolutely love them. They're super easy to use, but believe it or not, a lot of people have difficulty figuring out how to turn them on, because there are a couple of different buttons. So as you can see right here, you have this long button over here, which is used to control the volume. This, it does not turn them on or off. This controls the volume, okay? There's also a multi-purpose button over here, and this multi-purpose slash multi-function button that you see right here um, controls various things but it doesn't turn them on or off what you do have to use is this button over here so this button right over here turns the beats flex earphones on okay now a lot of people think you have to hold it down for a long time but you don't you basically have to hold it down for about a second give or take and then this light will illuminate okay so i'm gonna hold it down for about a second the light's gonna illuminate and i'm gonna release it and now they are powered on now the reason this is flashing is because i just reset the headphones for a couple of videos and essentially um, I put them back to factory settings so they're not connected to any device so they're in discovery mode right now but if you have your Beats Flex earphones connected to a device this is just going to be a solid color as far as I can remember um, the reason it's flashing is like I said they're, they're basically acting as if they're brand new right now um, I didn't get them that that long ago but I reset them so they're acting as if they're brand new that's why they're flashing and that's it that is how to turn on the Beats Flex earphones, a super duper easy peasy tutorial of showing you how to do it with some very simplistic instructions. Whether you're a beginner or you've had your Beats Flex earphones for a while, it's a good idea that you should know how to do this easily. If you like this video tutorial slash demonstration slash explanation, please be sure to give it an awesome big thumbs up. Let me know what you think down below as a comment. And of course, be sure to subscribe for more great videos just like this one. And that's all I have for you today. Thanks for watching.